Bro, what's going on guys? Zon here, back again with another video on the second channel. You already know how I'm coming. Hey, just before I get into the video today though, you guys have seen the title and thumbnail. Make sure you guys keep rushing the main channel, you feel me? This is my second channel where we sit down and react to stuff. But I have a main channel with a bunch of New York content dropping and I have a new banger dropping this weekend, you feel me? So make sure you guys go sub up there. A couple videos from New York have already dropped, so if you've missed those, go check them out. But yeah, let's get straight into today's video. Now, I ain't gonna lie, bro. I was scrolling down IG and I seen some wicked posts, yeah? And then I realized that it was posted by Didi Osama himself. So I went to the post, I started reading the comments and shit. We're gonna react to the video today. You guys can see what the post was. Basically, it was some YouTuber that talks to ghost spirits and shit, but these times he was talking to Noti Osama. I seen Didi Osama post it, and I actually commented on one of the posts, and I, it made me kind of mad, bro. I was just like, who the fuck is this guy? Who the fuck did this? Why would Naughty speak to this random guy, bro? Now I found the full video, you feel me? And I want to check out the full video today. And I'm just going to listen to what this it has to say, bro. Because at the end of the day, why would Naughty or someone speak to this guy? Someone tell me right now. It don't make any sense. So, uh, but when I'm seeing this, it was looking making me pissed off. So, today, I ain't gonna lie. I, I, I was like, we need to go check out the full video. Didi Osama posted it and he's rating it, bro. See what he has to say. Naughty Osama spirit box. This wasn't his first time. Shocking discoveries made. Hashtag draw rapper, bro. This guy is chatting shit. Let's see what he's got to say. Naughty Osama spirit Naughty, box. Naughty, it's me, Cody, calling out to you again tonight. Can you hear me? It's Cody. But like, bro, how? Why would Naughty Osama doesn't know you, bro? Oh. Yeah. There was an instance we had with uh, the spirit of Robin Williams over a year ago. Was this you that was coming through the device not? Was it? What is he chatting about, bro? This is what I'm saying, bro. Man's just chatting best shit. Can we bridge this connection? Me and Dido. Bro, why does it look he sound like Naughty though? Yo, no, 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 this is bad. Wait, what do you say? Well, Naughty. Bro, shut your mouth, bro. What's up with these ads, bro? Get the fuck out of my face before you get me tight, man. What did it say? Will Naughty choose light or the darkness? What the f? What does that even mean, bro? <laughs> Bring back that light. Bro, who the fuck is George? Bro, these men are just ch chatting shit, bro. I'm very confused. Oh, this the intro. Oh, that was the intro. That was the intro. Okay, now so now he's actually gonna speak tonight. Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. It's me, Cody, here. In today's video, I'll be attempting to get in contact with the spirit of Nadio Sama. Now, I've already. Wait, is this actually. I thought this was fake, but these candles look real, innit? Is this actually the spirit box? Ahead of this Bro, my man just made this himself. Intro, and I wasn't. This looks like a fucking lunchbox. Really expecting to get connected with Nadi today. We've been trying to connect with him now for a little bit over a year. And every week or so, I'll start up the SFI one with hopes of reaching out to Naughty again. But for whatever reason, I just can't seem to get that solid connection going. And just because that nigga don't know who you are, bro. Haven't had enough content to make a full session with you. But I think, bro, they, imagine you die and some random white guy's trying to chat to you. You're gonna be like, who the fuck are you? Why were you? Why is this guy gonna chat to you? To change. We've been waiting for a little over a year now to bridge this connection with Naughty. So I waste no time in the session uh, getting to asking some of the questions we've been waiting to ask him now for a little over a year. So without any further ado, let's get straight into today's video. Naughty, it's me Cody calling out to you again tonight. Can you hear me? Hello? 
But nah, why are you why are you pretending? You don't know this nigga. There's definitely a slight connection or a a little connection here. I can feel it in the room, but I don't know if uh, if Ethan's coming through for us on the devices just yet. You know it's my first time. Ethan, can you hear me? I see a box. What the fuck? <laughs> That little rectangle, what? What might it be for spirits to go and see Ethan, if you're here Bro, with what us the fuck is- Bro, this guy is just chatting shit, bro. I- we- we have, um, a list of questions here that I've been waiting to ask you for Oh, so we're getting to the juicy now. shit now. Me and your fans have been calling out to you now for a little over a year. Are you here with us tonight, Ethan? But it's weird. Going in what? Bro, they're, they're, they're touching him. What the fuck are they doing to him? Like I'm dead. Huh? All right, I can definitely hear some words coming through here and there, but because of how valuable this connection is, I don't want to waste any time being able to run through our list of questions. So awesome questions, then, uh, Dickie. That we Take that we've been to ask Naughty for a while. So I'm gonna get straight into asking some of those questions. Okay, so right long in it. Out. This guy's just long in it. Naughty, out. Ask the questions. One of the first things I wanted to ask you here. Uh, just as a little warm-up question, is is there is there peace in the afterlife, or do you still carry some sort of weight from your life here on Earth? My hands are glistening. Uh -huh. I can feel you coming through, Naughty. Keep coming through like that. Nick, no, 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 no. Hey, yo, what the fuck did my... I can feel you coming through, Naughty. Keep coming through like that. Nah, bro. No, 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 no. This nigga is LGBT confirmed, bro. We're LGBTK over here. We do not run for that. Bro, you haven't just heard Naughty. that. Listen to him. I can feel you coming through, Naughty. Keep coming through like that. Hey, yo, no. What the fuck? No. This guy, no, this guy is, does, is not a spirit box. This guy doesn't speak to spirits. Nothing special about him. He's just gay. I've also been uh, made aware by the ITC team of some comments in a video, I believe it was the Robin Williams spirit box session we filmed a little over a year ago now. Wow, okay, I'm very, very... And, what? Uh, that was Naughty? We've been trying to get in contact with Naughty Osama from that time period up until now. And a lot of you commented on that video saying that the kid that came through, that that kid sounded a lot like Naughty Osama. Bro, wait, is this shit actually real, bro? Why did that, when, when they were speaking to Robin Williams in that flashback, it actually sounded like Naughty, bro. But, uh, I want you guys, you let me know in the comment section, do you think that this could have possibly been the spirit of Naughty Osama trying to come through over a year ago when we had Robin Williams here on the session? Here's that clip right now. It's my turn. <laughs> interesting. No, Naughty K carried his own person, the same persona from fucking Earth to here. Yeah. 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 
Was this you that was coming through the device, Nani? Like what the fuck said, is that let mean? me know what you guys think in the comment section. Was that the spirit of Nadi Osama yeah, over a year ago? That sounded like Personally, it. I don't feel too convinced. It doesn't it just doesn't have the same tonality as what I'm hearing right nah, now. Nah, bro, that shit maybe sounds I'll, the same. I'll have a different opinion later. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Nadi, I wanted to start to ask you some more deeper and some more personal questions that your loved ones and your fans may be interested in hearing you talk about. First, could you tell us, Nadi, what does the afterlife being left to talk about? Deeper and some more personal questions that your loved ones and your fans may be interested in hearing you talk about. Being left to die like First, fucked. could you tell us, Nadi, what does the afterlife feel like for you? Is it anything like you've ever imagined here in your life on Earth? I exist in memory. Huh? Oh, he said this bitch is asking for her ex-love. Where is that bigger than the block? Bro, but there's not enough. But that's what I'm saying. There's not enough. See what they're doing now. Like, obviously, these men have taken over already. So it's like. Like, of course, you guys have already taken over. It's not like you were going to be big. You are bigger than the block. You're doing a great job, Naughty. Another interesting question uh, that I have here for you is if you could go back to one moment in your life, what would it be, Naughty, and why? Hey, bro, if I was Naughty, I would go back to the time when he was going to take the train and take an Uber, bro. Obviously, like, it might, everything else after the fact of him passing away might not have planned out the same, but at least he would still be alive, do you get it? Life. What would it be, Naughty, and why? But we cranked it up. But we cranked it up. Oh, he want to go back to a regular day, just chill. You are the future. Bro, these ads are getting me mad, bro. Just move for me, gang. Actually, move for me. I need an ad blocker. Somebody install an ad blocker for me. I know one of you man got ad blockers, bro. Give it to me, give it to me, give it to me, bro, for this new computer. We were tight. Hey, yo. Naughty. No, I'm kidding. You had friends, a brother, fellow artists that, uh, that you all worked with. Do you have any messages for those still living that are still walking the same path uh, that you were in your profession and just in your lifestyle, Naughty? Listen, I love you. All right, we're listening, bro. We're listening to you, Naughty. What messages do you have for the world and, and your loved ones? It's pulling you back. It's pulling you back. What? It's pulling you back. No, that's a fact, though. That's a fact. Do you feel like the choices that you made in life were were all worth it, Naughty? Tell D Dot. Love it where you told me. You want to practice? What? I love it when you talk. You want to you wanna practice? Practice what? Yeah, 
what do you think Bro, about what? Uh, why wait um, why does he keep just addressing Dido hasn't said nothing to Didi like this is why I think it's fake, bro. This guy probably thinks that DDoS is fucking brother, bro. Like, like Name this guy does not know what he's talking about. The streets today, even. Oh. That's a fact, bro. All right, I just they'll, want to they'll, remem up. they'll remember you for what you was, but not for what you could have been. That's mad. Loki, Loki, that's that. That's mad to deep. Some of these more uh, negative leaning questions, just in case it causes the connection to become severed. Because I can tell Naughty is strong, but I can also feel the connection starting to take a little bit of a dip. Naughty. The last question that I wanted to ask you of this type is Did you ever feel like you were running out of time when you were alive? Wow. Wait, what? We've got. Wait, wait. Before you die, there's a clock that comes ticking faster and faster. And further than uh, than I thought we would, but I'm gonna keep pushing even further and see if we can maybe wrap up this session tonight on a more positive note and see what kind of intel we can get from some of the spirits on the other side by letting our device run until we can no longer hear or pick up anything from Naughty anymore. Naughty. You seem to be well liked amongst your your friend group and uh, and at your school. Is there anything that you wish people knew about you that they didn't get to see while you were still alive? Oh, this is weird. <laughs> Mm. Naughty, your older brother Dee Dee. Oh, he does. He does know Dee Dee. Then is on uh, on the times that you and him spent together while rapping, making music, and and just growing up. If you could go back to just one moment in your life, what would it be and why? Um. Do you have any messages for your older brother, Dee Dee Naughty? Hi. That's my heart. That's my heart. I feel. I feel I was caring for. Hey, he's doing a good job, though, still. No, he is, still. Nah, that's a fact. Naughty. See, that this that is... makes me feel like it, it could be real, bro. Because it's just like, bro, that's something that my man would say. <laughs> Naughty, this is the last question I have here on my list for you today. But after this, I'm going to ask you one personal question that I have for you here. And then I'm going to let you come through on this device at your own pace to leave whatever messages that you have for your fans and the world watch. Come on then, bro. You're long in it, bro. Is there any advice that you would give to young artists trying to make it in the drill scene today, Naughty? Bro, don't just fucking don't live where you rap. Is that that energy that wrong? But it's also a friend. Yeah, I know. That's good. If you don't watch how you move. And lastly, Naughty, you get this killed. past year we've had so Aye, many. Hey, what do you man think? Do you think this is real, bro? Like, obviously, I believe like there's afterlife and shit like that. But like, the fact that he this man, this guy's talking to him. I don't know this guy. No, I didn't know this guy before he died. Why would he talk to him? Why would he not just go talk to Dee Dee or like talk to his mom or dad? Like, talented rappers and artists pass away due to violence and 
and drugs. Rappers like Rich Homie. Like, bro, Kwame. surely if this was real, the police would actually be raiding his house. They would be like violent. They'll be like, how the fuck are you doing this, bro? Like, surely. With violence and, and drugs. Rappers like Rich Homie Kwan, who died of a drug overdose. Uh, Julio Fulio, who died. Uh, Julio Julie. Fulio? Okay, yeah, this is fake. This is not. Julio Fu Nigga, who the fuck is Julio Fulio? Who? Bro, I. Are you fucking, bro? This guy actually, nah. This is not real. This is not real. This, Ju, who the fuck is Julio Fulio, bro? I want to see what this guy looks like behind the camera, bro. He probably looks like fucking Peter Griffin or some shit, like, bro. What the? Of a drug overdose, uh, Julio Fulio, who died uh, to gun violence, Enchanting, who also died to drugs, and a lot more. Have you had the chance to meet any of them or see them on the other side? Or have you seen any of your own favorite rappers that, that may have crossed over before you? What? Well, I was gonna say, bro, that you know when you die, bro, okay, if there is an afterlife and everyone's going to the afterlife, bro, it's gonna be like, ugh. You don't fucking walk around the streets and see little baby every day. So how are you just gonna bump into? There's gonna be bad dead people. There's probably more dead people than there are alive people, bro. Uh, yeah. Wow. I found an angel. Naughty. It's what's an angel? What is actually an angel? I thought Angel was just a dead flying guy. Such a lovely experience right, talking to you and uh, getting to know you in the time that we had together tonight. Now is the time in the session where I typically let spirits come through at their own pace and uh, I let them talk about whatever they wish. So you can come through naughty and you can use this time to leave whatever messages you have for your friends, your family. It's gonna be like, gra gra boom, nigga. Or the world watching. <laughs> You can also feel free to depart the session too if you oh, have some. Oh, else. drop a quick 16 bar. Let us get a freestyle. Oh God, that would have been viral. Oh, God, oh my gosh, bro. See, if I was making this video, I would have said, bro, drop a 16. That would have got, that would have, bad people would have fucked with that, bro. Or if you just want to go back up to the light with George, you can do that too. George is the tall guy. Who the fuck is George? George Floyd. <laughs> Hey guys, do Bro, you I'm gonna violate somebody. If I violate you, it's not my fault. Do you get me? We haven't used the astral wave today, so I'm gonna switch that on real quick and uh, see if we can get some more diverse replies coming in from some of the spirits in the area. Oh What the fuck is going on? Who the fuck is George? Who is George? Can I float in here? Of course, kid. Who is this? I love it here. Wait, what? Wait, the afterlife wow. is good? It's been one successful night. That's for sure. I knew the day would come when uh, yeah, do you guys think this is real bro do you think this is real bro enough to connect with the spirit of naughty as with every other session I'd like to thank you all so I much for fuck making up, bro I don't really care bro I just want to know if this shit is real bro like it to the end of today's bro do you guys think it this is you real? all who recommended this one and we've been attempting to bridge that no connection bro now for over a year we never forget your suggestions. It's just that sometimes some you've been trying to bridge that connection connect connect for a year. Why did it take a year, bro? Than others, and we hope to be able to connect with all of them. It has not even been dead Until for one year. Session, 
I'd like to thank you all once- Wait, has Nai even been dead for one year, bro? This guy is chatting shit, bro. This is- Bro, Nai- Bro, I'm pretty sure Nai died in 20- in, in 20, um, 2023. Oh, he died in 2022. All right, but I was about to say, I was about to say, I caught you in a Again, fucking lie, so you little idiot. Thank you today's video, and as always, until next time. All right, shut your mouth, bro. All right, you man, what do you man, what do you man think down below, bro? Let me know if you think that this is real, bro. I kind of want to see what some of the comments say still. Everyone just saying rip naughty, rip naughty. But like, bro, I don't know. I think I have to, I have to go watch some of his other videos to see if I can believe it. I feel like I don't believe it because obviously it's just like speaking to the dead is mad, but. This guy's whole channel, all he does is speak to the dead, bro. Oh no, he's chatting shit. He's chatting shit. I went to his channel, he's, he's speaking to Michael Jackson. Are you dumb? Yeah, nah. Now this is fake, bro. This, all right, you guys let me know down below if you think it's fake or real, bro. I don't know, bro. I don't know how I'm feeling, bro. I don't know. I don't, I don't think that shit's real, bro. And this is not something I can read out of 10. Bro, he speaks to every rapper, bro. If you go to this guy's channel, okay, he's speaking to Abraham Lincoln. All right, yeah. All right, I'm gonna catch you guys in another video. This shit's fake as shit, boy. This shit, this nigga talking to Bob Molly. All right, yeah, that's enough. All right, but I'm gonna catch you guys in another video. Make sure you guys keep running up the main channel. Go check out the main channel videos. And apart from that, it's One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Hold stay bang on my line. Hold on, bitch, just give me some time. What the fuck this bitch when I whine and dine? Who's that bitch when she looking so fine? Stop playing them games, I'm blowing my mind. Blowing my mind when I hear from behind. Oh my god, this pussy is mine. Bella stay bang on my phone. And Stacey won't leave me alone. Don't really mad, I can tell by her tone. And Leah just come back home for the bone.